when you got an iPhone from a friend, it's easy to unlock it without the passcode, but now it often comes with the Apple ID as well, which makes the situation complicated. Though it's tricky, we did find a workaround for this, and finally get access to the device. In this video we'll show you how to pull it off. Let's get started. First, let's remove the screen lock. To do this, launch iTunes on your computer. Then plug your device in, and set it into recovery mode. For iPhone 6S, is press and hold the side and home button simultaneously till you see the connect to computer indicator. iTunes should detect it and suggest an update or restore. Let's go with the restore. Click update and restore to confirm. And then agree to the terms and conditions. It's getting the firmware on your computer at this point. Once it completed, the restore will start right away. All the content and setting will be erased from the device. If you have difficulty using iTunes, use 4Uki instead, I'll leave the link in the description down below. When the hello screen comes up, go ahead and set it up. After connecting to a network, we should see a screen like this, it's asking for Apple ID and password. If you don't remember these information, move on to the next part, we'll show you how to bypass it. The tool we are using here is Formiki. There's a link in the description below if you'd like to download. So once installed, plug your phone into the computer. Then click on the blue button on each screen till we get here. It's saying we need a jailbreak, here's a link to the tutorial. It breaks down all the steps for a jailbreak. Let's give it a shot. First, download the two jailbreak tools. Once done, open Rufus. Then plug an empty USB thumb drive into your computer. Now head over to Rufus, and select the Checkrine ISO file. Now we can start creating the bootable drive. Here we are going to choose the right in DD image mode. Then hit OK for each pop-ups. Once done, restart the computer. When it boots up, hit F12 key to enter the boot options. Once in, select the USB storage device, press enter to confirm. Now we should see the Checkrine jailbreak wizard. Go ahead and hit start. It'll set your phone into recovery mode first. Then we can follow the instructions to put the phone into DFU mode, make sure to do it before each countdown is over. For iPhone 6S, is press and hold both the side and home button for 4 seconds, then let go of the side button but continue holding the home button for another 10 seconds, the screen should remain black. Once in DFU mode, Checkrine will start jailbreaking your device. Well done, now let's restart the computer, unplug the USB drive, and then launch for me key to start over. Click on each of the blue buttons the same as before, this time we'll see the confirm your device information screen and the start remove button. By clicking on it, we'll witness the magic of for me key in seconds. Well done, now it says the iCloud activation lock has been removed successfully. Let's get back to the device and check it out. This time we should see the data and privacy screen, 
which means the activation lock is no longer ahead our way. Let's move on. When you got to the Apple ID sign in option, make sure to skip it, and move on to the home screen. Then in settings, we should notice the Apple account has been signed out. That's it. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.